I'm not a typical pageant girl. I'm just your average girl next door. Just taking out my trash. I believe that a Miss America should embrace her natural inner beauty. It's about what's on the inside, not the outside that counts. I might not have much pageant experience, but I do have the life experience necessary to be Miss America. I've been playing piano since I was in kindergarten. Is that it? As an active child and now young adult, a healthy lifestyle has always been one of my top priorities. I'm going to let you guys in on my secret post-workout smoothie recipe that I think is going to help me win swimsuit at Miss America. You just need a little calcium, got to have your vitamins, a little bit of protein to keep you strong, and a little bit of flavor. Perfect. And as far as being Miss America goes, I'm already an all-American girl. I'm so proud to represent my home state of New Jersey. How much will you take for this? <laughs> oh, that's pretty. But growing up in Arkansas, I still have a little hint of that southern charm. Is this Jersey-licious enough? I originally got into pageants to promote my platform, giving the gift of reading. I've loved reading for as long as I can remember. I started the birthday book project as a junior in high school, and it sends gift-wrapped books to underprivileged children for their birthdays. The Birthday Book Project allows me to share my passion for reading, and as an English major at Princeton University, I've been extraordinarily blessed and hope to use this opportunity to give back to future generations. After seven long years, I'm proud that my state can welcome back the Miss America pageant to its birthplace and rightful home, Atlantic City, New Jersey. So join me on September 15th right inside those doors at Boardwalk Hall as I, Kara McCollum, your Miss New Jersey, compete for the title of Miss America live on ABC.